Hi everyone, this is Sharik and welcome back to Globetrot with Arabic. As you notice, I am in the kitchen because I am going to prepare a cake with my sister and my little niece here and my other little niece here. Where is she? Yeah, over there. She's here. So, we're going to prepare a cake. We will do this lesson in Lebanese Arabic. So, this is a lesson to my Lebanese Arabic students. So, before we begin, make sure you grab a piece of paper and a pen. Also, make sure you write down everything so that you can memorize things faster, much faster when you write them down. Try to repeat the words after me and the sentences. And you will now learn to use the names of these ingredients in Lebanese Arabic. If you like this lesson, of course, at the end of the lesson, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit on the bell so you can receive notifications from me every time I upload a lesson. This keeps me going and it motivates me to upload lessons every day. See you! I'll turn my camera and show you the details. Okay, so what do we have here? We have, apart from my niece who's already eating stuff, we have butter. So we say zibde in Arabic. Zibde. No, mama. And here mama. we have chocolate. We, we will say chocolat. Zibde ou chocolat. Okay. Shukamen anna. Shukamen anna means what else do we have? Shukamen anna. Cynthia, shukamen anna. Fi zibde, fi chocolat ou shukamen. Melech. Melech, salt? Are we going to put salt in the cake? Okay. Melech. So, melech, chocolat, zibde. سكينة هلا أنا عم ب... عم فرق البل أبيض من الأسفل Okay, so what she's doing is she's separating uh, the white of the egg from the yellow of the egg. So the white of the egg, we say bayad. It comes from the word abiyad, which is white. Bayad means whiteness. And the yellow of the egg, we will call it safar. Safar al bayd. It comes from the word asfar, which means yellow. Safar, yellowness. So. Bayad al bayd. Bayd means eggs. Bayd. So, bayad al bayd. Bayd means eggs. Safar al bayd. Bayad al bayd. Safar al bayd. Okay, shu kamen. So, to recap, safar al bayd. Bayad al bayd. Zibde. Melech. Tain. Tain means flour. Tain and chocolate. Okay. شو رح نعمل؟ شو رح نعمل؟ What are we going to do? شو رح نعمل؟ بدنا نسخن الفرن. نسخن means heat. We will heat. بدنا نسخن. Literally, we want to heat, which means we will heat. بدنا نسخن. We can also say رح نسخن. We will literally heat. رح نسخن or بدنا نسخن. الفرن. فرن means oven. So, رح نسخن الفرن. So again, رح نسخن الفرن. ع جيا ع حرارة ميتين. ع حرارة on the on the temperature of ميتين. ميتين is two hundred. ع حرارة ميتين. And then we're placing the eggs in the what is this? Since what do you call this machine? In the thermomix. In Lebanese, you will just say thermomix, probably. Okay. So I'm gonna say we put, we placed the eggs in the thermomix. حطينا البيض. حطينا we placed. حطينا البيض بالترمومix. وحطينا كمان we placed also. حطينا كمان الملح. وحطينا البيض. لأدي وقت سينسا. لأدي وقت means for how much time. لأدي literally for. How much? What time? And she said, sit today, six minutes. Sit day. So dia in Arabic is minutes. Day is minutes. Sit today is six minutes. Okay, so now we will wait six minutes. So I'm gonna say, rah nun tur, rah nun tur. We will wait, rah nun tur. Sit today. We will wait six minutes. I'll turn this off and come back. Okay, the six minutes are over, so we will say خلصو. خلصو means they are over. 
خلصوا الست دقايق you can also say دقايق if you want you can say دقايق or دقايق so خلصوا الست the six but we will pronounce it الست so خلصوا الست دقايق but with the liaison you can say خلصوا الست دقايق ايه سنتيا شو هلا بدنا نحط سكر سو هلا بدنا نحط we want to put بدنا نحط سكر sugar سكر سو اي كان سي هلا عم نحط we are putting سو وين يو بوت عم ات ميكس ات بريزنت كونتينيوس سو هلا عم نحط سكر we are putting sugar وهلا we will mix them رح نخلطن نخلط is mix نخلطن is mix them رح نخلطن is we will mix them وهلا رح نخلطن or and because now now we are mixing them I can say هلا عم نخلطن we are mixing them هلا عم نخلطن نرجع اوكي هيدا بياض البيض we said this is the egg whites اوكي فضينا فضينا is literally we emptied it فضينا is we emptied فضينا we emptied it the a sound in the end means we emptied it فضينا وهلأ شو سنتيا هلأ عم نحط we are putting عم نحط السفار سفار البيض هلأ عم نحط سفار البيض now we are we are putting the egg yolk اوكي ورح نحط we will put رح نحط الزبدة the the butter مية وخمسين جرام زبدة مية وخمسين hundred and fifty أكيد جيا مبسوطة عم تاكل chips جيا مبسوطة she is happy عم تاكل eating crisps chips جيا مبسوطة عم تاكل chips So I'm mixing them another time. 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 الشوكولاتة. Just to add another verb, we can say عم نزيد. We are adding عم نزيد. زيد means to add. عم نزيد. We are adding عم نزيد الشوكولاتة. عم نخلطهم. عم نخلطهم means we are mixing them. لا أدي وقت سينتيا. لا أدي وقت. عشرين ثانية بس. عشرين ثانية. عشرين is twenty. ثانية is seconds. عشرين ثانية is twenty seconds. وهلا which means and now. وهلا عم نزيد we are adding. عم نحط شو؟ الطحين. Okay. عم نحط الطحين. But look with the liaison we will pronounce it. عم نحط الطحين. So we put three spoons, let's say, of uh, flour. I say, hatayna. We put or we placed hatayna. Tlet malayg. Tlet malayg. So malaga is one spoon. Malayg is the plural. So if I want to say three spoons, I say tlet malayg. So hatayna. Tlet malayg. We put three spoons. Hatayna. Tlet malayg. Tain. وهلا عم نخلطهم we are mixing them بس لعشر ثواني just for 10 seconds بس لا for 10 10 ثواني seconds بس لعشر ثواني هلا بنحط البياض البيض اوكي okay. so بنحط بياض البيض we put the white of the egg the egg white ومنرجع منخلطهم so when I say منرجع منخلطهم literally I'm saying and we return and we mix them which means we remix them منرجع we return منخلطهم we mix them which means we remix them منرجع منخلطهم we mix them again 
نرجع منخلطن عشر ثواني سنتيا 10 seconds سو so, منرجع منخلطن عشر ثواني وي ميكس ذم اجين فور 10 seconds و سو وي ويل جست بور ذا ستف ناو رح نصبهم نصب از ليترلي لايك بور اور فينا وي كان اولسو سي ندلقهم ندلو اجين مينز بور سو بدنا ندلقهم اور رح نصبهم بدنا ندلقهم uh, بالصينية وي كان سي صينية سو وات ار ذا انجريدينتس انجريدينتس باي ذا واي از مكونات 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 المكونات ذا انجريدينتس المكونات لهيدا الكيك فور ذيس كيك المكونات لهيدا الكيك شو هن سينتيا وات ار ذي شو هن؟ طحين بيض سكر سكر شوجر سو طحين فلاور بيض ايجز سكر شوجر سولت ملح زبدة زبدة باتر شوكولا شوكولات The final step would be that we placed it in the oven for 15 minutes. So, حطينا الجاتو بالفرن, حطينا الجاتو بالفرن, ورح نتركه. We will leave it. رح نتركه. We will leave it. لمدة for a period of لمدة 15 دقيقة. رح نتركه لمدة 15 دقيقة. 15. So the 15 dia, we put it 15 dia, 15 minutes. They are over. خلصوا, they finished. خلصوا 15 dia. وشلنا الجاتو. شلنا means we took it out. شلنا, we took it out. شلنا الجاتو. ريحته بتشهي. ريحة in Arabic means smell. ريحته means it smell. ريحته بتشهي means it smell is. Uh, How do you say بتشهي سينتا in Arabic? It means its smell is like it opens your appetite or something. So ريحته بتشهي. You can also say شكله its its look. شكله بيشهي. شكله بيشهي. It looks delicious. It opens your appetite. بيشهي. So if something looks delicious in Arabic, we say بيشهي. So first of all, ريحته بتشهي. The smell is. Delicious. It it makes you. It opens your appetite. And شكله بيشهي. It looks delicious. It actually doesn't look as delicious as it is because it's a very slim brownie cake. But it's really very delicious. عن جد كتير طيب. I'll turn my camera and say bye to you. Okay, guys. So that's it for today. I hope you found it useful. Gia here wants to say bye. Ule bye, Gia. Hi. Bye. Hi. Bye. And bye. Hi. So that's it for today. I hope you found it useful. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more Arabic language lessons and learning tips. And don't forget to click on the bell because this encourages me to upload more and more lessons every day. Yalla, Jia. Uli, bye. 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 Bye.